مرحبا In this video, I will give you a little introduction about the Arabic alphabet in general. So let's get started. The Arabic alphabet has 28 letters, including consonants and long vowels. Now, don't worry, I will talk about them later in details. For now, just have an idea. Now, there is five things you need to know about the Arabic alphabet before we start learning them individually. First, letters are connected in both print and handwriting. And second, the way we write in Arabic is in horizontal lines, from right to left, opposite the English writing. Arabic is regularly phonetic, which means what you say is what you write. And that makes writing in Arabic quite easy to learn, comparing to other languages. Be aware that Arabic sounds use a range of mouth and throat positions than English. And that a challenging part for some students. Because in order to produce some letters in Arabic, you have to use your throat and some muscles that you don't use in your native language. Now finally, each letter has an independent shape, isolated, initial, middle and final position. And that depends on the location of the letter in the word. For now, we will focus on the independent one. So in this lesson, I will teach you the first four letters. Let's start with the first one. So the first one is Aleph. Aleph. I pronounce this letter as an A sound and you can find it in the word Ahmad Ahmad it's a famous Arabic name or you can find it in the word Apple Aleph is very easy to write it likes a vertical stick make sure when you draw this letter to start from the top to the bottom Aleph now let's move to the next letter which is ba ba it looks like a plate shape with a dot underneath like the english letter b in the word book it's exactly the same pronunciation an arabic word for this letter would be bab bab which means door Make sure to write the letter from right to left. Ba. Now let's move to the next letter, which is Ta. Ta. Again, it looks like a plate shape with the two dots above. Like the English letter T in the word table, it's exactly the same pronunciation. An Arabic word for this letter would be toot, toot, which means blackberry. Again, make sure to write the letter from right to left. Ta. Now let's move to the next letter, which is tha. Tha. Again, it looks like a plate shape with three dots above. You can find that letter in the first part of the English word there. An Arabic word for this letter would be thaqafa, thaqafa, which means culture. Again, make sure to write the letter from right to left. Tha, tha. Now let's sum up what we learned in this video. We learned the letter Aleph for Ahmad and also we learned the letter Ba for Bab door and also we learned the letter Ta for Tut meaning Blackberry 
And finally, we learn the letter th for thaqafa, culture. I hope you enjoyed this lesson and make sure to revise this class and I will see you in the next one. Ma salami.